Hello everyone, this is Stevio here and we are back in Iowa and we are looking for a piece of land. There is a whoa 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 whoa. Oh, got another truck here coming. There is a huge desire around this area for fixed up trucks. We are trying to build a new dealership. Man, that's a small dealership. We need to build something better. Hold on, hold on. I'm trying my fastest. I'm try going fast as I can there, buddy. Man, these traffic around here. The Diesel Brothers want to expand their business over here in Iowa. And we need to find a piece of land along this street. We want it highly visible for everyone running down this main highway here on Flint, Iowa. Where can we go? Hmm. Hmm. Stop here at local Casey's and see if we can uh, talk to the locals about some possible land purchase. Man, is that a good looking GMC right there. Hmm. 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 No luck so far on finding a piece of land, but we are gonna go take a helicopter ride to see if where exactly from the air we could get a piece of land to purchase around here. Because uh, let's just say uh, this traffic is a little bit crazy and kind of hard to stop and look along the highway. It probably is a death trap. There is a couple of small businesses, but they aren't very big, so I don't think they're going to be much of a worry for us. Diesel Brothers want to make something very impressive, and mostly they just want to fix up good diesel trucks, like they always do. I don't know about this, this thing is a little shaky here. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, now, now it's evening out. All right, this is Fairbanks deer right there. Uh, yeah, let's go down this street. Well, this is full of customers here, or businesses. Uh, yep, can't go and looks like this is mostly houses along here. This is a possible piece of land right here. I don't know if we get clearance to actually cut down these trees. We do have a pretty big uh, parking lot right there. Oh, uh-oh. Looks like we're going to do a low-line buzz of Platte Valley here. Sorry, Buck. Sorry about that. I think we figured out where we need to purchase the land now we just hit need to go talk to the banker all right all right let's go see about this land on the ground here listen to this thing purr yeah this thing got some power to her all right so I guess uh, at least the good thing is we are going to be right next to Casey. So whenever we want to stop for a short little break, we can always get some nice Casey's pizzas. All right. So this is our piece of land that we're going to purchase. Yeah, we are right by. It looks like this is a co-op or this is a fertilizer plant here. back 
ourselves to blame for our love. Oh, I tried to hold you close, but you just left me. I need to find a way out from this hell by myself. I keep calling, but you won't seem to listen. I keep walking, but I can see you following. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, oh, oh, oh. I will leave and not come back anymore. Oh, 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 oh. You will feel the way you've been treating me. I think the Diesel Brothers are going to be proud. Look at this. Yes, perfect garage. We can get under here. We can work on suspensions. We can pull out that diesel motor and we can work on it. Now we just need to get some vehicles around here to make this place look like a diesel garage. So I built this. This is the new garage. And this is kind of the old garage back here in the woods line here. Yeah, yeah, they could have bought out another garage. That's what I was really going for. This is definitely a used garage here. Look at this. Hot rods, shell, motor oil. Yeah, all the good stuff here. Great looking garage here. Phenomenal. But they had to upgrade because Diesel Brothers, they go all in. Man, do I love that show. Now, let's get some diesel trucks. All right, just got some Casey's coffee. While I'm thinking about it, make sure you like this video. Leave a comment if you want. And hey, happy holidays and keep being awesome. All right, let's get back to what you guys want to see. Here we go. Yes, we got it built. It's all built and all the trucks are there. Oh yeah. Now that is a truck dealer I want to see. Well, it's not really a truck dealer. It's more like a truck shop that specializes in upgrading trucks to be monsters and ultimately 
very cool. All right, let's get this thing on the lift because it sounds like I have to do a little bit of tuning on this thing. There we go, lift that up. Now let's look at our stock of trucks here while we're doing this. Yes, yes, we got plenty of customers already knocking down the door here. We got an old boxed-in Chevy here, Silverado. Man, just looking good already. Nice and clean, kind of has that orange tint to it. We got a lime green Silverado here. Yes, a 2500 HD with an Alice transmission in it. Mm, can't beat that. Does have the Dirty Max in it. We got this nice and clean because you know what? We got a lot of farmers around here and they like the flatbeds. We got a dually here, Power Stroke. We decided to put a nice flat coat of green on this thing. I just kind of like it, to be honest. Now we got this GMC All Terrain with a Dirty Max in it. HD. Look at the suspension on this bad girl here. Yeah. We got the Ram. Limited Ram here with the Cummins, of course, in it. Kind of got a uh, nice uh, glossy green paint on it. Hmm. Looking good. Of course, we got the Bronco. Look at that suspension. Hmm. Reminds me of Bumblebee. This is the way Bumblebee should have been in Transformers. And, uh, we put the rice tires on this old F100 here. Whew, look at the suspension lifts on this thing. Took the doors off of it. Man, is that thing clean and big. One of my favorite trucks over here is this Power Ram. Look at this old girl. It's got the almost perfect, uh... What would you call this on it? Like a lime green? With, look at them clean chrome rims on it. Ooh, it's got the painted smokestack. I don't know how long that's going to stay painted, though. This power ram with the Cummins in it. Man, we have to do this as a giveaway truck, don't you think? All right, so we get a lot of customers. A lot of our customers want to put on service beds like this one right here on this Ram Cummins here. Man, is that, it's got all, it's got a, a power arm here, it's got an air compressor, a welder, it's got everything you want. And of course, we gotta have the Fords in here. We got a Ford F450 here. The juice is loose. Yep, we're gonna put a, on a bed for this, put a lot of upgrades on that power stroke get it for the farmer's dream truck here. No Diesel Brothers would be complete without a three axle Patriot Tires Diesel Power. DieselSellers.com. Man is that Ford clean. All six doors of it. Mm. Yep. That's how we get our customers trucks in here. We got an all chromed out Silverado here. Man. Is that thing going to be heavy? But, whew, it's going to be clean. Man, is that a clean looking chromed out to the floor Silverado. We got another customer's Denali here that we're going to put a uh, bed on. Of course, we're going to have, we got a, this one right here. One ton HD with a Dirty Max in it. Wants to uh, fix it up with a nice service bed on there. Of course, we got the TRX Ram here. We're doing major upgrades to it. Clean, very clean TRX. Of course, in the back of the garage here, we have all of our old projects here. We got this a Chevy here to the floor. Not a normal build for us, but we dropped it to the floor. And we're going to put an old diesel engine in here might take this to uh, use this for a parts running vehicle yep we're just gonna put a little patina on this and keep it the farm fine fresh clean look but thank you all if you want to see more of diesel brothers custom garage here 
let me know down in the comments like the like the video but thank you all no all have a great holiday season